Tuesday, voters hit the polls in Michigan in one of the big races, electing the state's governor. Tonight, we sit down with Democrat Mark Schauer to talk about his run for governor. NBC 25 attempted several times to contact Governor Rick Snyder's campaign. Those calls and emails went unanswered. Stephanie Parkinson tonight explains where both candidates stand in this year's gubernatorial race. After campaigning as one tough nerd in 2008, Republican Governor Rick Snyder is now seeking a second term in office by telling voters he's their accountant and their governor. But his Democratic opponent, Mark Schauer, argues Snyder's approach has come at a cost. Rick Snyder's brand of trickle-down economics, giving big corporate tax breaks by, while cutting education, raising taxes on working families and seniors, doesn't work. You have to support public education. It is a fact, as much as Rick Snyder tries to refute it, he's cut money to the classroom. Governor Snyder's campaign argues he's invested $660 more per student in K-12 education over the past three years. Another move the Snyder administration has touted, right to work. But Mark Schauer says high on his list, if elected, is repealing that. Let's be clear, right to work was not about jobs. It was not about economic growth in Michigan. It was a political attack. My vision for Michigan is that we become a high-wage, high-skill, high-growth state. On his campaign website, Governor Snyder claims since he's been in office, Michigan has seen more than 250,000 new private sector jobs. He also says Michigan is first among the Great Lakes states for per capita personal income growth. And, under his leadership, claims our labor force has grown for the first time since 2006. But Shower claims cuts have driven jobs out of the states. The film industry and the television industry that was really starting to get a foothold here and Rick Snyder pulled the rug out from under that industry and I want to retool uh, and expand those uh, those incentives. I'm going to help small businesses. Um, I'm also going to provide tools and incentives for companies that create jobs here in Michigan. Fixing Michigan's roads. Both agree this is important. Snyder has recommended more funding be allocated, but the legislature has yet to act. In Lansing, the legislature, I'll lead bringing Democrats and Republicans together uh, and, and put all ideas on the table and make sure we have a fair solution. Because I'll tell you what, not only will fixing our roads, bridges, and underground infrastructure make Michigan more attractive for investment and businesses to come here, it's the best jobs program there is. On Tuesday, voters will decide if they want a second term with Snyder or if they want to elect Shower to serve in Lansing. Stephanie Parkinson, NBC 25.